For years, vitamin supplements were recommended commonly by Western doctors. People were so used to taking mega doses of vitamin C whenever they felt a cold coming or popping a multivitamin every morning just to be safe. But are they really good for your health, or at least, harmless? Dr. SEBI had a completely different take on vitamins, and recent scientific studies keep showing up and proving him right every day. Let's learn a little bit more about Dr. Sebi's take on vitamins and the difference between vitamin supplements and minerals. Vitamins are trace compounds found on food. Let's set the record straight, food has vitamins. They are natural compounds found in all fruits and vegetables. In their natural form, they're good for you, which is why we recommend a diet based on fresh fruits and vegetables adhering to the nutritional guide. However, it's when man artificially makes a vitamin supplement in a laboratory that the trouble begins. A supplement made in a laboratory is a chemically inert, non-electric substance that won't do your body any good. As Dr. Sebi said, there is no vitamin in the world that is made by man that complements the human body. Because it does not have the electricity that it should have, just like naturals plants have. Minerals are elements that make up the human body. Quite literally, our body is made of elements, and those elements are minerals. All of life is made with these same elements, so it only comes to reason that minerals complement the human body, since they share the chemical affinity with it. When our diet and environment make our body systems acidic, minerals are depleted and disease can ensue. It is then that natural, electric alkaline herbs from www.veganchoicefoods.com are recommended, like sea moss. Vitamin supplements are made in a laboratory, while minerals are found naturally in herbs and plants. Plants and herbs take the minerals from the soil around them and convert them into an easily digestible liquid that complements the human body. While vitamins? They are extracted in a laboratory, where they become inert, non-electrical substances that do not complement the human body. As Dr. Sebi said, vitamin supplements are artificial, it is not something made by nature. Vitamins can have harmful side effects in your body. People are used to popping vitamin supplements like candy, but they can have very real harmful consequences for the body. It is proven that too much vitamin C can cause digestive disturbances such as nausea, diarrhea, and stomach cramps. Excess vitamin A has even scarier side effects since it's been proven that it increases the risk of lung cancer, and excess vitamin E can increase the risk of heart failure. So think twice before that multivitamin, 